na wataalamu wa matibabu wametishia kugoma baada ya mazungumzo baina yao na wizara afya kuhusu malalamishi yao kugonga mwamba wataalamu hao kupitia chama cha madaktari na wataalamu wa meno KMPDU wametoa ilani ya siku saba ya mgomo kidai kuwa wizara ya afya haikuwa na nia ya kushughulikia matakwa yao hapo jana chama cha madaktari wataalam wa dawa na meno humu nchini kilikutana na maafisa wa wizara ya afya kuweka mstakabali wa kushughulikia tatizo la madaktari wa wanafunzi we had promised that we are going to give a seven day strike notice we were to give it on monday but uh, the government of the ministry invited us for a meeting yesterday and we delayed it hoping that there will be meaningful conversations sadly nothing worthy was discussed naibu katibu wa chama cha KMPDU Ms Kela Dennis alisema juhudi za kusuluhisha swala hilo zilikosa kuzalisha matunda we were told that the only three options one they either go and work for free two they wait for july there were three they were told that they wait to see if the treasury will okay them to go work without pay then when pay comes in july they be paid in arrears chama cha madaktari sasa kinasema hakuna matumaini yoyote yale ya kuafikia suluhisho ndipo sasa kimesalia na uamuzi wa kuandaa mgomo we are here to give a seven days check to starting today that will expire on the next week on tuesday midnight on 12th so from wednesday there will be no doctor wataalamu hao wa matibabu wanasikitika kwamba wizara ya afya imeshindwa kutimiza ahadi zake na badala yake inaendeleza dhulma na unyanyasaji dhidi ya wanachama wake and we met in january of last year with the governors and the minister for health or csf health and we had put an implementation matrix on the cba of 2017 that is still active up to now sadly and report that nothing that was agreed on has ever been implemented solidarity forever so hata hivyo madaktari hao wamesema nafasi ya majadiliano ingalipo ilikuepusha mgomo kasi cha namasha darubini